Hey everybody, I'm Trish from Fold Factory and this is your 60 second super cool fold of the week. Thanks for watching. So what would you do if you got a piece of mail this big? If you're me, you would take out your ruler and measure it. So most of the direct marketing that we get these days is a USPS flat size or smaller, which is a maximum of 12 by 15. Well, this is definitely not 12 by 15. So the first thing I wanted to do was to figure out the size and how it mailed. So this is 19 and three quarters by five and a half shrink wrapped and it's rigid. So I realized this is a first class parcel. Totally awesome. So um, this was designed by um, Minnetonka, Minnesota-based agency Next for HP. And this is for the big Graph Expo show that's coming up that I can't wait for. Um, and this piece is a highly targeted direct marketing piece um, to show off the HP 10,000 press, which is a digital press with a 20 by 29 and a half sheet size. Um, and so what they're doing is they're sending this to targeted lists of people, three different targeted lists, um, to invite them personally to schedule an in-person demo. So uh, this is this piece is a wonderful demonstration of what the press can do. It's just fascinating. So as I said, um, 19 and 3 quarters by 5 and a half is a sleeve. Pull it out and opens up to a really cool large format pop-out accordion that is um, 28 and a half wide by 19 and 3 quarters in this dimension. So every panel is 4 and 3 quarters in width. And um, so if you watch Fold, in the week, Fold of the Week, you've seen uh, the pop-out accordion, right? It's the basically score, 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 die across the fold, and then you pop the little box in the opposing direction, and you get this wonderful dimensional result. One of the great things with pop-out accordions is you, you get that dimension, and you get that little pop box, and you can make little call-outs or do something neat with imagery. Um, and so they chose it as a focal point for some of the key call-outs and features of the press. Now, you'll also see how rigid this is. It really stands very well. Um, this is on a 16-point Tango C2S, um, and the reason they did that is because um, they wanted to show how the press can actually handle up to an 18 point um, board. So they wanted it to be, you know, they're, they're, they're showing the intensity of color, they're showing customization in the data, um, they're showing sheet size, and, um, you know, just a lot of the different features all together in one piece, which is just fascinating. So these were die, score, hand pop. Um, the boxes were hand popped. Uh, they did about 2,800 of these. Um, and then there's also, of course, the sleeve, insert, shrink wrap, and mail. And these mailed as first class parcels. So they were a few dollars a piece to mail. But if you consider, you know, they're selling presses here to a highly targeted audience. So just a tremendous use of um, you know, material, scale, design, mail, uh, way to stand out. Loved it. That's your 60 second super cool fold of the week. Oversized pop out accordion mailer. Forward this to your friends and colleagues. Keep the dialogue going. And viewers, please send me your folds. If I use them, I'll send you free stuff. Visit fullfactor.com for more ideas and inspiration. And remember, think finishing at the beginning. I'll see you next week. Bye.